<sighs> hey, bro. Okay, am I gonna start the video with like, I mean, it's too high. That's good. That's great. Do you like that? I like that. That's fine. Guess what? It's Saturday. Guess when this video has to go up? In 24 hours. I feel like it's too I'm not even like, look, get over it. What if I'm back here? No, get over it. I had a busy week, okay? Like, I literally was like, I was busy from like, 9 a.m. to like 11 p.m. every day this week. I couldn't film a video, I couldn't do it. But today I have off, so what am I gonna do today? I'm gonna film this video and edit it all in the same day. Is that a bad idea? Absolutely. <laughs> Videos take me like seven hours to edit. I was like, what video am I gonna film? I don't even know. What am I filming right now? I'm gonna wash my face, but like, I'm not gonna, it's not a skincare thing. Like, <laughs> we're talking. I have some things on my mind. I hope you like the video. Uh. <laughs> I don't want to get too close because you'll like look inside my pores. Honestly, at this point, I'd rather be Voldemort and not have a nose than look at my blackheads all day. Like, honestly, I've had it. For the week, it was so bad because I was just like working all day. I was driving for like an hour and a half each way, like a couple times this week, and my car doesn't have AC. Why does my car not have AC? I'll tell you why it doesn't have AC. I don't know. I don't know why it doesn't have AC, okay? I have no idea. But my pores were like gaping holes, literally like this big. So I had a fat pimp right here, and it's pretty much almost gone now. Okay, let's start the video. God. Because I've been working so much, I'm not hydrated enough, so my lips have been chapped, but not like flaking dry, just like, well, flaking dry. We're gonna start with the Jeffree Star lip scrub, okay? Cherry soda. Like, it just tastes so good, you wanna eat it. The first thing we need to talk about, I am 28, and I'm still afraid of the dark. Like, I think that's a problem. Like, should I be afraid of the dark at 28? When I let my dog out, I go with him because he can't be trusted, and I bring a flashlight to my backyard. For example, my light switch stay is here, and my bedroom door is here, and I go, whoa! and I run into my bedroom because I'm so scared. Like, I feel like the day that I don't run is the day that the thing is gonna get me. What's the thing? I don't know, but it's gonna get me. Oh my God. I'm gonna throw this out the window. Got it. Does anybody do this? I feel like I'm not the only one. I mean, I'm probably the only 28 year old. I have to have my computer and I have to be playing a TV show. Like, it can't be quiet either. If it's quiet, like, oh my God, I'm hearing every noise. The fridge makes a noise. I'm like, oh my God, it's a serial killer. It's coming to kill me. Like, this is it. How do I just get over being afraid of the dark? Do you know what I mean? Like, how do I get over it? Stop being a I don't know. I just want it like that, you know what I mean? Like, that's all I want. Is that too much to ask? Like, God. I gotta wash my hands now because we're sanitary. Ow! Guys, I bit my nail back so far. Like, I bit it, like, Whenever it gets wet or water touches it, it actually feels like Satan is peeing on my nail bed. Ow! I have to put my hair in like a headband so I don't get my baby hairs wet. And I'm gonna look like Caillou. Oh my god, I look like those girls who play soccer. I have like my headband and I'm just like... You know what I mean? This face washing routine is dedicated to girls who play soccer. Guess where I got this headband? I don't know. So, oh my god, I just had to move my candle. I have this fear of me washing my face, and then I come up and my hair is on fire. Mom, I'm sorry if you're watching this. My mom has like pyrophobia, like she's literally terrified of fire. I have this fear of my whole ponytail just being like, whoa, just like 34 inches of flames. I'm using the Tatcha's deep cleanse. My next topic of issue, so I have these like superstitions that when I ask people, I feel like, does nobody have superstitions? Like, I really do, I look so ugly, holy. Wait till I put my hair back down, you're gonna be like, you're so cute. Just right now, kind of go like this. I have these superstitions and I have a couple of them and I literally didn't realize like how much I like live by them. If I have chips, I have to wish on a wish chip. Obviously, everybody knows what a wish chip is, right? It's the chip that's like folded, like a taco. I have to make my wish like as I'm biting. So it's like, yeah, I wish for it. Like, I can't do it before because then it won't come true. And I can't do it when I'm done, obviously. And my wish has to be done by the time that I'm done chewing or it won't work. My other one is like when I blow on an eyelash and make a wish. I have to wish on my eyelash too. And you have to make the wish like, I'm wishing as you blow. Does anybody have like those superstitions? Not like those ones, but you know what I mean? Like where you have to do something like that? Or you, if you don't, like you're gonna die. I don't have the ones that are like, oh, a cat walking under a ladder. <sighs> Face washing part of stuff, I have to pee. My mom hates when I pee. She hates when I burp and I pick my nose on camera. My mother has had it with me. Um, but I really have to pee, mom. Sorry, mom. I've been... Watching these like scurry Watching these Korean skincare videos these women are like smacking the heck out of their faces like 
So I started doing it because there's all these different all these different techniques and honestly It makes a huge difference. I think I'm gonna make an IGTV video How to apply skincare not that anyone cares or anyone wants to know but guess what? I'm gonna give you what you don't want. So that's what I'm gonna do Treatment lotion, Le Mer. I mention this every time I can. I'm literally like, guess what I use, Le Mer. Koreans or any Asian, they don't have pores. They're literally poreless. It's wild. This one is like probably the, one of the most annoying things in the whole world. And everyone's going to agree with me. And if you don't agree with me, you're just like difficult. And you're a, an idiot. And I hope you fall down a flight of stairs. Like honestly, it just soaked right into my skin. It's like, is it even there? It's in my skin. And I'm so hydrated now. My skin is awake and alive. I'm alive. I'm just using a Dr. Jart Peptin, Peptidin. I'm using this. It's a sample I've been using. Honestly, I have, a, oh my god, another superstition. I just saw 444 on my camera timer. First, I have to say what I'm appreciative for, and then I have to make a wish. Got it. It's a firming serum. I don't, here's my issue, okay? I cannot be the person to tell you if firming serums or any of these things work. I don't age. <laughs> it kind of smells like Sprite, and I really like Sprite. But Sprite gives me acne. When I'm like 40, ew guys, that's in like 12 years. Dad, I'll know if, it, if I was doing the right thing. So in 40 years, I'll tell you if it's working. I mean, then I'll be 80. I mean, whatever. The thing that's really annoying. So do you know what's so annoying? When you go to like throw something in the garbage or you go to like throw your phone on your bed, the thing just does like a whole gymnastics routine. Like it's literally Nastia Lucan. It's literally Gabby Douglas. And it's like hits the bed and then like flies across the room or like you put your phone on the counter. It just like somehow slides off a flat counter and hits every part of the bar stool on the way down. And you're just sitting there like, can you relax? Like this is literally not the Olympics. The other day, threw my phone on my bed, what did it do? Bounced off my bed, hit my wall, back to my bed, hit the wall, hit the dresser, floor. I was like, that doesn't even work. Like you had to go like, literally so annoying, I could puke. You know how girls can like sync their periods? Okay, so you're on like the same cycle. I feel like me and Steve have like synced our diarrhea cycles. Every time he has like diarrhea poo, so do I. And I don't know what it is. Like whenever he poops like that, like it's like literal water poo, you know what I mean? Me too. So, and, a, and a, 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 I'm trying this sample of a moisturizer I got. Energy boosting gel moisturizer. I kind of like it. Honestly, like I don't know that it does anything. Again, I prefer to have anti-aging moisturizers. I don't care about anything else that they do other than do not age me. I got carded for a lottery ticket. I was like, sir, I'm literally 28. Like you're lying to me. That's very flattering. You didn't believe that. You made that up. You're a liar. You just wanted me to feel good and thank you because I did. I want to be carded until I'm literally in my casket. What else is I just gonna say? Oh yeah, diarrhea. Guys, I had Chipotle for the first time yesterday. I've never really, I don't think I've ever had it in my life. I'm trying to remember and I don't think I have. I didn't have diarrhea. Everyone was like, oh my God, you're gonna have Chipotle and your whole booty hole is gonna explode. I came home, I pooped and it was like, like one white poop. You know what I mean? Like the good poops. The poops that like when you have a one white poop, you know your day is gonna be good. And then I woke up today thinking like, oh no, it's over. Like today I'm gonna wake up, boom, volcano poop. No. Maybe that's the thing. I changed my diet a bit. Okay, after the Chipotle sentence, I changed my diet a bit. I stopped having fried chicken. I'm eating a bit healthier because I'm not trying to get sick like I did last year. And then my skin got bad. So I think I'm the opposite, okay? I need to eat fried chicken and unhealthy food for my skin to glow and for my body to look good. I'm the opposite of all of you. I went to, oh my God, look how much better I look now. I look like Caillou's grandpa with my hair up and I look like so cute with my hair down. Okay, wait, but I need to put on these eye masks. So I don't know what I was thinking. Yeah. Every eye cream in the world, I'm screaming. Every eye cream, every eye, everything is for like anti-aging and like not getting lines. And I don't have lines, okay? Like I'm youthful. So I've been looking for things and I've been trying things and I hate everything for de-puffing because I look tired and I've never not looked tired. I was literally like 13 and my teachers were like, did you get enough sleep? So I found these, I try, it's not a sentence. I am trying these. 24 karat gold hydrogel eye patches. You're just not gonna focus. I feel like you have one job, camera. Focus on what's in front of you. There. I don't listen to how long it says. 10 to 15 minutes. I put it on for 45 minutes. I put it on and people, I went on, 
Can I just speak in a normal sentence? I put it on and then I went to work and everyone was like, Whoa, like you look so refreshed and awake. These are life changing. They look like this. So I do it twice a week. I switch it both times. So like once a week I'll wear it like this way and then once a week I'll wear it like so the fat part is like on the inside. Oh, I can't do that. I was gonna try to do that like a beauty guru, you know what I mean? And like in front of the viewfinder, but like I literally can't. I feel like beauty gurus just can't ever see what they're doing. Yeah, and so now I leave this on for 100 hours. I wish it was like socially appropriate for me to like walk around like the town with these, because I would just leave these on. If I could just like go to like the grocery store like this. I like went to Sephora yesterday, because I still had gift cards, thanks kids. And it was the like VIB Rouge sale. Well, it was the VIB sale, but I have a problem, so I'm a Rouge member. And so I like went ham in Sephora. So I went like shopping with some of my friends. So I'm gonna do a haul video as well. And I'm gonna explain how my day went. I'm really like sick of the fact that every time I don't film, what am I doing? Every time I don't film, cause I'm like, I'm just gonna go spend the day with my friends. It is the funniest video and it would have been so funny. So I'm gonna like make a video explaining how it went while I do a haul. The last thing that I have to talk about when you put things in the microwave and it is like popping, it is exploding. It is so loud. It sounds like a horror movie in the microwave. And then you take it out and you burn your hand on the bowl but your food is freezing cold. Like, what do you mean you're cold? How are you cold? There's actually no way. What there's no way is, is that you're cold. Keep that same energy. How are you gonna burn my hand and then freeze my tongue? Oh, almost lost my mask. I'm doing too much facial movements and the mask almost flew off. Okay, I need to be like more like Botoxy. Don't you dare pop in the microwave, be like And then be in the, my, my mouth like I, that's, I don't know how to be a cold sound. Yeah, anyway, so that's the end. I have the week off moving forward. If there are any video ideas that you have, comment them, DM me, whatever, text me them if you have my number, give me a video idea, I will do it. Obviously, like, if you have an idea, I'll do what you want. Unless it sucks. This was probably the most boring video you've ever watched in your whole life. But you know what? I tried, okay? I have a whole life outside of this. Oh my god, yesterday we saw a guy shooting meth. Anyway, that's gonna be in the other video. Because the whole day was wild. Like, literally like a whole mess. Thanks for watching, hope you like this video. I know you did it, you don't have to lie to me. But what you can do is pity like this video. But before that, subscribe to my channel. I forgot that. Click the button that says red, as my lips right now, because they're so chunk. Do I have anything red? No. Like this video, give it a pity like. I need to design a like, a like thing. You know, I have like a actually so subscribe. I need to give like an actually so pity like. Pity, what are we pitying today? Pity the bags under my eyes that are gonna be gone. Why is my nose like toucan Sam? Oh, I should be on a cereal box. My Instagram is at actually so ugly. I don't know if I posted a selfie. Did I post a selfie? I really need to just pull up. I'm gonna take a couple this week. They're gonna be fire, fuego. Okay, internet, what I need you to do is act like connected. Cause you're gonna, you're telling me you're connected, we'll act like it. Guys, I just dropped a whole carton of eggs. 18 eggs, I have to go clean it up now, bye.